And what's going on everybody, Dex Max here, and today I'm hitting you with a, uh, another different kind of video. It's a guide video for the French Folk Hero's Grave, or the Stranded Graveyard. Uh, this little dungeon, um, right at the beginning of the game. Uh, so, before you try to tackle this, I suggest you get three things. Well, you need at least one of those three things, which is the, uh, Stone Sword Key. Like it needs two stone sword keys. Um, then the next thing you need is cure poison or any type of um, poison relief um, items because of that. And the next thing you'll need is a bow and some arrows. Um, that'll be useful later to get a, a secret item. So I guess we'll go ahead and jump right in. All this is poison right here, but right here, and some poison's gonna stay because um, it sticks on your armor, but that's fine. Um, that is what we're gonna be worried about. That's okay, we can take that thing out. So this one goes up and down, but as you see, as you can see on the little cubbies, the left and right, just want to follow it. And you know, you can always play it safe, you can come here. Do not come out um, right there, you gotta wait for it to go right back down first. Now there's also going to be skeletons in this area. Or shadows, shades, I don't really know what they're called. Right back down, this is going to be quick. Now I don't believe these guys respawn. So wait for him to go back up, roll down here, and run. Because it's going to wisen up and it's going to come down and it's going to switch. And then you're going to come right here. We're going to see where. So it goes back up at the end right there and you're gonna jump off right here I knew I saw it now we got these imp things as we seen before they got a little bit more help than the ones we fought um, in a couple videos ago This whole dungeon is made to confuse, so you just got to be on your toes, especially if this is your first time through this dungeon. Keep your distance with everything. All kinds of traps. Oh, that was a lot farther than I thought. Come through. Hit it with an arrow. Good. Let me turn off notifications. All right. Got this little fool right here. Still ended up getting me. There. There's probably more in this next room as well. This 
best to play it safe. Pick up any items you can. There's not too much here. Um, in terms of normal items. But there are a lot of good items. So over here is going to be... A duo... Um... Grafted Scion. There's one there, and the other one, I'm not sure where he's at, but there there are two of them. But there's a really good Talisman right across. But we're not going to attempt that yet. We're trying to take out that uh, Chariot first, so we're going to come here. And then right here is a ledge you can jump down to. Then there's nothing there. Then we're gonna jump down here. At that point, we'll come across this elevator here. And then there'll be another um, Banished Knight uh, Phantom at the top. right around the corner. There he is, he's right there. He will teleport around. we uh, lose some health here. Those are right where we need to be. Just need to take care of him. Alright, he's done. We get a stone sword key. Now we're where we need to be. Alright, we're gonna try this again. Wait to hear the vibration, fire an arrow down, and there we go. So you, basically you want to wait for that vibration of your screen, and then release the arrow. Um, and that's how you get the Earth Tree Great Bow, and some great arrows. Now obviously I don't have the stats to wield it, um, but it does do holy damage, so... It does scale with a uh, face, so maybe I will use it uh, one day. Alright, so we just jumped down after defeating the Chariot with the pots. This way is to go back up to the beginning. Down here is you know, towards the boss fight. We use our Wonders Physic. Now at this point, um, I would recommend... I'm not going to do it. Um, because I like making things hard for myself. Uh, I would recommend going back to the side of Grace and get all your equipment back, but um, I'm not gonna do that. So down here is towards the boss fight. Up here is towards a very important item that I will need for my build. And you know, I know a lot of people would use it too. Oh, Here. All right. That guy right there. Now, I'm going to try and go around him because I'm really running out of stuff and I don't really want to fight through those guys again, so... Um, this guy isn't required to kill. It's only if you want to, so. Maybe he is required to kill. Weird. Uh oh. Well, this isn't good. Time to use the bow. Uh. 
I'm gonna do what you can. Whoop. Your little cheater still around like that. Eventually, his aggro is gonna um, expire. I'm gonna wanna go back. Come on. Cool. <laughs> so, you just wanna bait him until he gets back. So, right around that uh, flame post, he's gonna start eating. Aggressive again. And just kind of get him this loop. Okay, there. there. This is what we want, the dragon communal seal. This will bu uh, buff your dragon incantations. Um, and yeah, it takes the place of the seal. And gives you a nice little dark hand type look. All right. So with that done, we don't have to come back here anymore. Instead, we'll go down. But first, I'm gonna cut it and I'm gonna come back with my equipment. So, be right back. All right, we are back. Uh, there should be about four more um, normal enemies. this lead anywhere? I oh, know. Okay. I know where that leads to. Six more. Unfortunate. These guys are so annoying. Okay. Wondrous Physic. Here we are at the boss. Now there's a there's a little shrine America that, that helps out. Um, I don't know how many times it's gonna take because this is a very small area, with a very large enemy. Um, it's kind of, in my opinion, bad design, but I think a lot of people will agree that this early game dungeon is um, pretty difficult. And yeah, so I'll probably cut to the one where I actually win. You don't have to see all my attempts. Mm. As you can see. It looks like he does take a bit of bleed damage, but it might work in my favor. Oh, I'm out. Just a lot of rolling. does choreograph a lot of his attacks. Oh, and he got me. That's unfortunate. But yeah, that's pretty much how it's gonna go. Um, yeah, I'll just cut to the one where I actually win. Yeah, very difficult boss fight. It seems like he's weak to um, bleed, but yeah, I'll uh, just keep doing this until I win. Okay. 
Great. Heart racing, you know. Heart racing, and that gives us a nice little fifteen thousand souls. Uh, we got a golden seed, and um, we also got a rare um, ash, which is weird ulig. So now we got both these. I prefer uh, ulig for sure. And yeah, retrieve my zero runes. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, uh, the guide to the French folk hero grave or stranded graveyard dungeon. Um, it's definitely no joke for new players or new characters for that matter. Um, it took me about two hours to finally go all the way through it and then collect all the items um but i hope you enjoyed the guide um and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one later